All right, guys, made it to my work target. And check it out. Sick. I needed this one. Oh, man. I need, not the whole set. Because I already have the Porsche. So I knew somebody that needs it. Mm, I don't remember off the top of my head. But these. And this. Are coming for sure. Now let's check down here. See if they got any red editions. Which I doubt. Because this target is really the one that's picked through already. Pretty quick. So, I guess I just got lucky with that Deutschland set. So, not looking too great right now. That's about it. Come here. Alright, made it to my local Target about my place. Went through the bin. I thought it was fresh. It was pretty fresh. I found this in it. <laughs> Did not have that. I'm not sure about that yet. But of course, I found another one. This, of course, to the homie. But I might keep this one because I already shipped out his box. And I just found this one. So I might keep this one for myself. Now coming to the pegs. There's nothing. Multi-packs. No premiums. Except for the Loki and the Masters of the Universe. Um, monster trucks. Yeah, here's the new matchbox. I thought, oh, I thought this was a Bronco. It's the Land Rover Defender. Oh man, they got these cars. Still no GTR or, or Datsun. Me, I think I'm gonna use this actually. I don't really like it like that. Maybe if it was a different color. I would have taken Hummer, but it's in yellow. Not a fan of the yellow, although I do like some yellows. Not this one though. Alright, I made it to the Walmart. Oh, no. <laughs> Ooh, hello. What's left? Connie's like, ooh, I kind of like this blue. And that sucks. Oh, wow, everything but the Porsche, I think, is here. Yeah. There's one, two, three, five. So no Porsche. P1 is cool. Not for me. The Mustang is cool. But not for me. Wow, they put temples in the front and the back. Wow. They did pretty good on that one. Might take this, these two. And this. I think it's already been through. This is number nine. Oh. I'm gonna drop my cars. Already, already been through. All right, coming to this side where the premiums usually are. We found one, just the Baja Bouncer. Ah, wow, I missed it. I missed it. <laughs> I missed it. But just trucks. We got the Loki and the Spider Man. That's about it here. And then this set. This set's not too great this year, in my opinion. Uh, two M2s down there. That's about it. All right, target time. <laughs> I haven't seen the Datsun. There's one with the Datsun. I really want it, but I don't want to. I don't even know how much they go for. Honestly, I know they're muscle machines. The muscle, muscle machines don't really go for much. I still want to buy separately. Whoa, this thing is tiny. Tiny ass motorcycle. Oh, and Bugatti Chiron. Sick. Oh, there's a tiny Chevy too. And a Corvette. Hey. That should be pretty cool. I never looked at those like that. I'm leaving that there. The new five pack. Still no GTR or Datsun. Ooh, new premium. Nice wheel. Oh, those are big wheels. I might have to take that. <laughs> oh, this one. The red editions. 
I think it's already been through though. Oh, they beat me to it. Is this a treasure hunt or no? No, I don't think so. Like I said before, I haven't been keeping track, so don't roast me and saying that's not a treasure dummy. I just don't pay attention. I don't care for them keeping track as much because the fun is the hunting. You just know what's com coming out, but you don't know when it comes out. So that's why I don't keep track anymore. It's all about the hunt, in my opinion. I'm sure if you guys hear me, because I was covering the mic. I don't see any civics or 83s, and that is all right. But this one was the one with the red edition, of course. I don't see anything. Any new five packs? Because there's this one with like the Hot Wheels tempos. Hot Wheels team tempos, and it's pretty cool. Alright, we have an unboxing today, and let's get into it. I don't want to get into say anything and let's just get into it so as you guys do know the hot wheels legend store did start so you guys know where this is going <laughs> here is the hot wheels legends tour of 2022 the nissan scott and gtr r32 here it is in that purple let's see if i can get it open here's a closer look at the card art it's pretty cool in my opinion oh almost dropped it here's the back the top, the front, it looks like it's already coming off already. And then here's the back. That is a dope Legend Tour car, in my opinion. Uh, I do like this one over the Silverado, although the Silverado has grown on me a lot. Although, I did get rid of it. Um, I might get that back. This is not for trade, I only ordered one. I should have ordered more, but, well, didn't want to be too greedy and just got one for myself and that's about it. All right, guys, made it to my work target. Doesn't seem like they restocked recently. If they did, I missed it. G case. Oh, that thing actually moves. That's pretty sick. The engine, we'll see. I didn't notice that before. That's pretty cool. Don't think I'll get it though, but that's still pretty cool. Um, I don't think there's anything else. Although I did see a friend of mine post a new 9-pack with a red oh, sick. with a red Audi RS5, I think it is. No, the white one, that's a new, this one, but in red with a new Lambo, I think it was. No, a 350 or 370, something like that. It was pretty cool. Um, but I don't think he picked it up. Hey, Batman's. This is a new set. Nah. We got a lot of the color shifters. Camaro, custom van. No Evo. That's probably from a different set. Monster trucks and no matchbox. Alright guys, I made it to this toy store. I'm not exactly what it, sure what it's called. But they have a pretty good uh, monster truck selection. Like, check it out. They have the back to the future DeLorean. I never expected to find that here. Yeah, I think they, like, whatever they have is, like, behind it. So, like, there's another one, Drag Bus, there's another one, this, there's another one, another Drag Bus, there's another Drag Bus, and another Drag Bus, Corvette. So, like, whatever's first is what you see. More Drag Buses and stuff like that. That Volkswagen, like, pair is cool. Then they got the pullbacks. They got a lot of pullbacks. Ooh, the, ooh, that's cool. I'm gonna look at that. They got some premiums here. Down here, not up there. <laughs> here. Ooh, this one I want for the wheels. Yes, sir. That's coming home with me. Oh, and then behind me, they have the, the team transports. I was about to say TTs. Well, they are TTs. And then the nine packs, the five packs, nothing too new. But I am gonna take one of these because they do have a, a handful of them. IWR, the C8, C8, Supra, Supra, Supra. Imagine like one has no wheels or anything. <laughs> That'd be crazy. Taking this, um, 
And I might take this actually, because this is pretty sick. You build it yourself. Hmm, I don't know. Fifteen dollars. Might just take this instead, just these two. Let's see what else I can find in this store. So I was just looking at them and then like I read the price behind the monster truck. I was like, I might get this because I think I know somebody that needs it. Six bucks, not bad. So then I decided to check behind this. They are taxing hard as hell. $25 for one Supra? Is that because? No. They probably get this for retail or over retail or something. Because god damn. That's crazy. Do anything over there? That's crazy. Oh, you know, I'm leaving now. No, thank you. I'd rather just not find it at all. <laughs> what about the Evo? Yeah, sorry. Kind of expensive. Oh, I'm looking at this mat, and there's a mad manga in there. That's pretty sick. It's in the carpet or whatever. Another one. Another one. And then just the Technics. That's it. Nothing else here. I have vehicles or cars. All right, made it to my Target, but my place. Let's see what we got today. Oh, new Impala. Cool. Some more MR2s. Let's see which ones we got. We have left-hand drive, lights down, right-hand drive, lights up. Cool, cool, cool. Pentega in red. And that's about it. For Matchbox, at least. <clears throat> For Matchbox. Um, more Audis. Another one. Looking for that Jason. I think my man Scott got me on that, though. Hopefully. Because he has a box for me. So I don't know if he still has it or not. But we shall see. What's in the set again? I think the whole set. Oh, the cool combi's gone. Of course that one's gone. This one I need. I know I have all the ones that I want. So, <clears throat> so went through the dump bin. And if anything, looked up. <clears throat> Excuse me. And found the set. And I kind of like this one for the wheels. It was like a drag setup. But obviously they're not slicks. This one, I bought one in the past. And this wheel is huge. So it's going to be hard to like find that on something because this one's already like the bigger size um same thing with this one well this is the bigger size and then the regular size here and then this one i like the wheels but the axles are tiny so i don't think i'm gonna get that because i don't want to do too much work and this one's cool but the tires are really thin so i do like this van the gmc panel van probably one of my favorite castings as well the one probably my favorite one is probably the i think it's the michelin one from the tires or the that car culture set but this one i think i'm gonna take axles don't look like you gotta do much to it so slick drax setup pretty cool on the 70s van what's up guys you already know we got an unboxing from the man larry webb himself on instagram let's get into it all right to start off the unboxing we'll start off with this one the Datsun 240 Zamac. This is actually pretty cool. I actually got this at a pretty good deal. So thank you to him. I got the uh, 64 in Continental. The Lincoln Continental. Um, I wouldn't say I'm trying to collect all of them. But I'm trying to collect as many as I could. I do have the black one. I have the Zamac. I do have a teal one. A blue one. And a brown one. But those are the uh, closed ones. Not the convertible ones. I do like the closed ones better than the convertible but these were just on his uh, Instagram, so I was like, I'm going to cop them because they're pretty dope. Especially this Dragon one, because I do have the Celica and I think the SD300 or 400, something like that, from this set as well. Here's a little little premium, the Nissan or the Nissan Concept 2020 Vision GT. It's pretty cool from the Gran Turismo set. I do have the GTR, and that's the only other one that I had or have slash wanted. So now I have the two that I, I wanted from that set. Next, we have another Continental, but this is from the Hall of Fame. So this is actually pretty cool. With the real riders. And a tan interior and the flame. This is actually my first uh, Hall of Fame car. I've never had one of these before. It's pretty cool to have in my collection. 
Of course, I had to get the Boombox Super Treasure Hunt. Um, this is the non-factory sealed one. I do have one factory sealed, I do have a loose one, and now I have the non-factory sealed. So, glad to have that back in my collection because I did have one before. Um, la not last, but I do have two mystery cars. I will open probably on camera. Uh, hopefully there's a Bugatti because there is a chance of Bugatti because he would choose randomly for people. These are the ones with no windows. I think you can scan them, I'm not sure. And in order to actually purchase from him, you have to like screenshot the post, send it to him with the message, and then in that message be like uh, car A1 or B3 or C2 or something like that, whichever car that you want from that post. Now, you kind of have to do it quick because he does post like, I want to say 20 to 30 to 40 posts each time he does a sale. Um, we daily actually sometimes um and this one i didn't do as quick because i didn't want it but i wanted it at the same time like i wasn't gonna rush to like get it as fast as i could but if i were to get it awesome if i didn't that's fine save money for me but it is the convention of the dodge power wagon in blue from the 20th i think from the or oh, charlotte from 2020 and here is the number so yeah, this one is pretty cool to have in my collection. I have another convention piece. And I have, I think, three or four conventions. Um, not including the ones from this year or last year. This is from 2021, I think it is. Yeah. Or 2020, sorry, my bad. Um, but yeah, that is everything I got from Larry. And of course, you can't forget the uh, unboxing or the cracking. Hopefully, hoping to get a Bugatti, which this is not a Bugatti. This is a quad bike or a sand stinger. This is pretty cool. I think I've had one of these before when I was a kid. Probably messed up the wheels. I probably like crunched them the wheels and they were like cambered and stuff. Pretty cool. And for the second one, fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Oh, it comes in a baggie. Uh oh. It is, it's a Bugatti! Oh, sick! Oh, that's awesome! That's awesome, I cracked a Bugatti! This is not for sale, this is not for trade, this is staying in my collection. That's awesome! Sweet! What's going on YouTube? I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Here's everything I picked up in store and online. Um, let's start up here with the premiums. Here's the three, three of the premiums from the Deutschland set. We got the Audi S4, you got the Mercedes Black Series, not the Chase, sadly, but I will have that one soon. Um, the other Mercedes C-Class, I actually like that one a lot. We also got the 70s van from the Ninja Turtles uh, set, I guess you can say, but we don't have that one, four wheels. Uh, we got the Hall of Fame uh, 1964 Lincoln Continental. I actually like this one a lot. As you guys know, I did mention it earlier that I do want to try to collect those minis I can. Obviously, you're not breaking the bank, of course. Um, we do have the two mystery models that we got. Um, this quad bike or whatever. I forgot what it's called. The Sand Stinger. And, of course, the mystery Bugatti that we, we cracked open last clip, I think it was. Here's what I picked up in store. Got another Silverado Red Edition. This one's for me. The Tacoma, Toyota Tacoma from the Matchbox. This one's also for me. <laughs> All of them is for me now. Uh, we got the Acura NSX from this set. Um, the only one that was missing was a Porsche, I believe, from when we saw. Um, which I, I didn't mind, honestly. I honestly was gonna leave this one, but I decided to take it because I like it. They're both blue from the set that I like. The Nana SX is a darker blue, which I like more, but it's still cool color combination. Different than the white, gray, and the dark gray that they that they uh, released earlier. Moving on down here, we have the two Lincoln Continentals, the 19, 1964 Lincoln Continentals. The one, this one's from the Dragon Wagons. The one's the Dragon Livery. Pretty sick. You got this one, the Hippie Morals, I think it is. It's actually pretty trippy. I didn't even, I didn't even look at it like that sparkles sick what does that say right on <laughs> that's funny the zamac two datsun 240z i think this is my first datsun of this series like this 
uh, casting. I don't think I've had any other ones. So that was the Zemek one. That's pretty sick in my opinion. Um, let's go to these, this one, the, another premium, essentially the Nissan concept 2020 vision GT. It matches the GTR that I have loose and in on card. That's pretty cool. Another super to the collection that is not worth a lot, but I, I don't know why I just like it. Um, I have obviously, like I said, I have the factory sealed loose and now non factory sealed carded. So that's pretty cool to have the trio. The 2020 Charlotte, is it Charlotte? Yeah, Charlotte Dodge Power Wagon convention car. Here's the number, pretty high number. Got it for a pretty good deal. But if you're interested in drooling a trade and you want it, just DM me on Instagram at Derek Stike, so we can set something up. And last, but certainly not least, the Legends Tour Nissan Skyline GTR R32 in that purple. No number, of course, because it's from the Legends Tour. And the banner, that flag. But yeah, that is everything that I picked up this week. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram at Derek Peace.